In today's AI driven world, you can find two kinds of professionals. The first kind are the professionals who get anxious about how AI might impact their jobs or disrupt the industry. But then there's another kind of professional, the one who wants to understand AI, create it and lead with it rather than feel threatened by it. What kind of professional are you out of these two? If you are someone who belongs to the second group, someone who wants to master AI rather than fear it, then stay with me because this video will guide you on the right path. I'm sure that you all have already completed a few AI certifications or online courses. But let's be real, no matter how many online modules you complete, nothing comes close to the depth, credibility and expertise you gain through a genuine PhD. In today's video, we are diving into how professionals can apply for a part-time PhD program in AI at IIT Kharagpur, one of the most prestigious institutes in the country. If you are someone who is serious about high quality research in AI, then IIT Kharagpur should definitely be in your wish list. IIT Kharagpur is one of India's oldest and the most respected IITs. And in today's video, we are diving into how professionals can apply for a part-time PhD in AI at IIT Kharagpur and one of the most prestigious in the country. So to apply for a PhD in Artificial Intelligence, here uh, you will be applying under the Faculty of Engineering and Architecture, often referred to as FOE and A. Within this faculty, there are 29 departments and one of them is the Department of Artificial Intelligence, which will be our main focus today. So if you are a working professional, here is what you need to do to apply. So here is the eligibility criteria for you to apply. You must have either a BTEC, BE, MSc or an equivalent degree with at least 70% marks or a CGP of 7.5. Along with that, you will need a minimum of two years of working experience after your qualifying degree. This is the basic eligibility just to get shortlisted for the test and the interview stage. Uh, so what are the research areas from where you can choose for? Uh, so you can choose from artificial intelligence, machine learning, cognitive science, computer vision, automation and robotics, natural language processing, signal processing, remote sensing applications, pattern recognition, digital libraries, cyber physical systems, uh, medical informatics, big data analytics, climate model evaluations and many many more. This wide range ensures that you can align your research with your passion and as well as your profession. So now uh, IIT Kharagpur offers a PhD program for working professional with minimum residential requirements. So let's break this down. Uh, let's break these terms down and uh, let me explain them to you. Being a PhD for working professional means that it is a part time PhD. Now let me clarify upfront, a part-time PhD is a fully recognized uh, degree by UGC and it carries the same value as a full-time PhD. The expectations, rigor, outcomes are exactly the same both for full-time and for part-time PhD. The words minimum residential requirement means you will be expected to fulfill coursework requirements and spend some time on the campus that is in IIT Kharagpur which is why it is called a minimum residential program. Don't worry, the institute understands that the understands your busy schedule and therefore it will keep uh, the entire program which will be very working professional uh, schedule friendly. So now let's move on to understand about the coursework structure of this program. So the coursework structure depends on your qualification. If you have a bachelor's degree, you will need to complete at least 20 credit points and if you have a master's degree, you will need 16 credit points. There is no compulsory general courses like English or management, so it stays focused on your research domain. 
your course plan will be customized and decided after you've been selected and may even include some online courses making it much more flexible and working professional friendly also you'll need to submit a no objection certificate from your employer this is extremely mandatory however remember this does not mean that your company has to fund your phd just that they are okay with you pursuing it next most importantly you will need to identify a faculty member in the department whose research matches your interest you must 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 submit a research proposal approved by this faculty member as a part of your application once that in place then you can then only you can fill up the application so once you got the approval on your proposal then only you can fill the application so now let us understand the admission timeline so the admissions and id kharagpur happen twice a year for the july session the application window opens around february till march and for the january session it will open across uh, in october to november so if you are planning for the january 2026 intake this is the perfect time to prepare your research proposal connect with the faculty and get all your approvals in place so that you can fill up the upcoming application to sum up if you are working professional who's passionate about artificial intelligence and wants to con contribute meaningfully to this field a phd from iit kharagpur could be a transformative step in your journey so start planning get your proposal ready and take that next step towards becoming an ai researcher from one of india's top institution don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel for more updates on phd opportunities research tips and scholar stories in case you are looking for a phd mentor who can guide you and support you in your phd admission journey then you can reach us on the whatsapp number given below thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one